Hey guys, welcome to another video. Today we're going to be playing some Build a Boat for Treasure. I'm going to be showcasing a special glitch that I have found after I was just playing around with this special thing. I'll show all of it to you from the very beginning. So what you're going to need for this glitch is you're going to need a thruster. It doesn't have to be these ultra red thrusters. You just need a thruster. Any thruster will do. You would probably only have this gray thruster. I have the ultra thrusters. Then you want to make use a decent material like gold or titanium. I'm, I'm going to do this with my friends, so that's why I have three of them. Anyway, and then you just put it into this four block square. Then you take it and stretch it all the way as far as you can. Thing is, I actually stre didn't stretch mine too far because I didn't have, I only have a thousand titanium. But you should stretch your pull as far as possible then make sure this is all built on top of one glue block you click the glue block it should fall down if you are unanchored then what you want to do is you want to anchor which means that now your blocks will float in midair so if i turn this merging level off you'll see this block will float that's what you need. Then you click the thruster. And as soon as you click it and it starts moving, you want to hit, you want to put the block and the entire pillar will stop. Um, I missed. I'm just going to use this pole. This pole here. Okay. Got it. So now... You can just delete this. I'm going to delete this too. Then there's some really cool things you can do with this. It's overall now. Now what it should do is if you stand on it, it should launch you. Like that. There's some really cool things you can do about this. I'm not going to go and... I'm not going to show you all the things you can do. I'm going to show you my favorite thing though. And, of course, the glitch. The whole purpose of the video, pretty much. So, you take a hinge that's unanchored, you put it on the pole. You can put anything that's unanchored on this, and it flies. This is why the glitch is so important. So, now that you know that it will fly, it slowly drops down. So, you'll hit the rocks and it will well, you know, die. But if you put three glue blocks on top, then put something per se, I'm going to take gold. It won't launch. When if the glue wasn't there, it would just go. So, I'm going to put the glue down. You want to have at least three blocks of glue, just to be sure. And use your strongest block. So I'm going to use gold. Then you just put it down and pull it out. Until it's at least one block and a half out of this. Or maybe two blocks, whatever size you want. Then you're going to need a pilot seat. You use these to fly to control jets and you can rotate things with them so if i just took a servo put a pilot seat with this servo then if i'm in it i can just whoop, and combining these two things you just put your pilot seat on and try to sit down without it blasting you off then you click the two glue you should launch now 
This might be a bit slow at first, but you can see that I'm slowly going down. That's bad. I'll hit the rocks and it will not be good. See, I'm already touching the grass. But with the but with the pilot seat, you can go up, down, left, right, and you can speed through the stages. Right now it's slow, but as you can see, I'm slowly getting faster. So you can go top speed and zoom through the stages with this. It's not too expensive. You can use any block you want. All you need to do is do what I showed you and then not jump out like I did and not be an idiot. Hmm, let me redo that. And the best thing that when you die or get the chest, whatever, you can just do it again. Like, look at this. I can just replace two blue, grab my gold again. I'll just do this. Then I have to grab my chair. Jump in. Okay, yeah, getting in the seat probably takes the most time out of all of this, besides actually getting to the end. But seriously, it just takes so long to get in the chair. It's really hard because it kind of just launches you off because of the whole conveyor thing. What's happening to my other block? Eh. So, now, it's working again. Now, I should be able to do this. So now, all I have to do... Is this. Simply just go up. And you should try to go up and down to get the hang of it, side to side. Once you get used to it, you're perfectly fine, but you should still move a bit at first, so that you'll go a bit faster. Try to move up and down, that actually makes you get faster, well, faster. Now you can see that I am slowly speeding up. And that means that I will be able to get straight to the end pretty quick. So as you can see, I have 2,375 cash. And this doesn't like, brings you to the end, kills you, you get no cash. You can get to the end, get a golden block, and 200 gold. I can show you. After this, I'll have 600 gold exactly. I should have 2,600 gold once I get to the end. And as you can see, this volcano, no problem. The mountain's a little too tall. Oh, and make sure you don't hit the, the spikes on top. That will kill you. But since the mountain's so tall, you can just move around it using the DNA key. The W is to go up. The S is to go down. If you're on mobile, I don't know the controls on mobile since I've only done this on PC, but you should still be able to do this just fine. And if you have a friend that's on PC and has a lot of blocks, ask him to make this for you and you can just do it with him and grind a lot of gold. And as you can see, I'm about to get to the end. Once you're at the end here, you want to grab your deleting tool. And as soon as you get to around this point, you just delete. Delete everything. And you walk to the chest. As you can see, look at my gold. This isn't a joke. This will actually give you all the gold. Boom. 2,601 gold block. This is one of the best grinding methods I think I've ever found. And with this glitch that I found, you can make giant, like, escape pods from ships that will go straight to the end. 
Like, seriously. I can just stretch this way up. Delete this hinge. Put another hinge. And this build may take a while. So, I think I'm just going to cut the recording quickly and be right back. And we're back. So, I made this kind of pod thing. And got in here with a jetpack. Now... I can launch in this little, like, escape pod. So then I can just bring this little pod room thing all the way to the end. And this thing can still move left and right, look. So this is one of the craziest glitches. You can send me some comments and show me what crazy builds you've made with this if you made an entire flying aircraft carrier that would be so cool you could make multiple flying things with this without using any jets so you don't even have to use jets and you can still fly and this is probably faster than jets if i have to say yeah it's probably faster than jets well, normal jets that cost $4,000, but supersonic jets maybe are like the same speed, but this is still a pretty fast way to get to the end and grind, grind lots of gold. And while you're grinding gold, you just gotta get to the end three or four times, and you can make a... a full golden rod instead of silver... Obsidian, what block you were using, you could turn straight into gold block. And you can just keep grinding gold blocks to turn some of, some giant builds into complete gold. So, send me in the comments pictures of what crazy things you've made using this entire ships that are that can just fly over the water to the end quickly send me a pic and i'll be harding the comments that have been sent showing some crazy builds that have been built with this method um thing is a couple but getting your seat broken or something hit could absolutely wreck the entire glitch and just make you a stick on the water so uh yeah that's a little bit of a problem but if you're careful you won't get hit look i'm almost at the end too so this is one of the best gold grinding methods I've ever seen. Tell me if you've ever found a glitch yourself or if you found another glitch that you want me to showcase. So if you find something using this glitch that could be cool and good for gold, then send then tell me in the comments and i might make another video on on that glitch just tell me how to make it and what it does and i'll heart the comment and see if it works and then record it in a video we're running out of time though so i think that's going to be it for this video leave a like if you like the the new glitch and it helped you make lots of gold like and subscribe if any of the glitches that you've seen here have helped you in a game and i think that's it for this video bye guys see you next time